To my aunties. This is your aunties channel. Channel. Subscribe to my aunties channel. Aunties the channel. <laughs> oh. Say bye bye. Bye bye. Hey Glammies and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a super fun video and this is my get ready with me game day makeup routine. So I'm a cheerleader in college and basically every single time I have a game um I do the same makeup look because I love it so much. So I'm just going to share with you guys how I get this makeup look. And yeah, that's it. So basically, I chair for a college basketball team, the women's and the men's team in my college because my school is small and we don't have a football team. So yeah. First, I start off with my brows. And I do my brows very light and natural for cheer. I use my ColourPop brow pencil in black and brown. And I'm just going to fill them in slightly. So now I'm going to take my NARS Radiant um, Cream Concealer in the color Dark One and I'm just going to use this to clean up my brows and since I'm usually rushing coming from class or waking up really early to go to a game, I'm not really that precise with my brows. It does not take me that long to be honest and I'm pretty good at doing really quick makeup it's something that I've perfected because I do not like to wake up early but I still like to look cute like who does not so I'm just gonna take the Shani Cosmetics E21 brush and I'm gonna use the E16 side and just blend this out And right now I have a lot of acne because I'm on my monthly. But whatever, I still wanted to make this video for you guys. Because I've been wanting to do it for a while. But my last semester at school got pretty hectic and crazy between chair, dance, max credit hours, life. The world was not letting me live, but you know what? I made it happen, it was successful, and... I'm going to move on to bigger and better things. So now to set my brows. So now to set my brows, I'm just going to take this Professional Natural Lash from CoverGirl. And I'm just going to set them. This is actually a clear mascara, but I use this to set my brows. I just love how it makes them look. So usually I would move on to the eyes in like a beauty video, but today I'm going to move on to my face. I make sure to moisturize my face really good because I have very dry skin and I'm going to be out chairing all day. And it gets pretty cold in the gym where the cheerleader stands, so I don't want to look crackly. So I'm just using this Smashbox primer. It's an oil primer and I really love it for my dry skin. I need to actually by the um actual thing but you know college student no money no money gang even though some have money i need to get on their level i'm just gonna rub that all over my face and i'm being very careful by my face because i have a cut i don't know if you guys can see it yeah i have a cut right here so yeah, I need to be careful with that. So usually for game day, I go in with my Anastasia Beverly Hills foundation stick in the shade Coco. This is what it looks like right here. And I really like this foundation stick, but 
it's like winter now and my skin has lightened up so it doesn't really match but i'm gonna see if i can make it work yeah i need to be really light-handed with it and i also go for a very light coverage foundation when i'm chairing because i don't want to feel hot and cakey i like a really natural face when i'm chairing because the eye i think is bold enough for the whole look to come together so to add with this foundation, because this one is actually more of my color, Black Radiance Foundation in the shade Brownie. This is like perfect for me, especially in the winter. I'm going to take this buffing brush, put some all over, and smear it all in. And I need to take my rose water so I can blend out the Anastasia Beverly Hills Stick Foundation better because it's a very thick consistency. And I'm just going to go in circular motions. Guys, can we talk about Kalani? I really love her. Like, she can do no wrong musically. I've never heard her put out a bad song. She's an amazing lyric, lyric, lyricist. Woo, I can't say that word. And her music just always sounds perfect to me. I don't know, to be honest. I just love her. So I'm going in with my NARS Creamy Radiant Concealer. This time I'm going to use it to highlight. And trust me, on game day, I be doing this super fast. I'm just going slow for you guys so you guys can really see what's going on. And oh my gosh, my front door keeps opening. I'm sorry, guys. We have this annoying alarm that lets you know every time somebody leaves the house. Hashtag never sneaking out. Mm, I'm going to do my nose. But I'm going to skip out on the forehead because I told you, as I told you guys, I have a lot of acne right now. So no need to highlight that. So I'm just going to buff it out with the same brush because realistically, I'm getting ready for a game. I don't got time to be switching brushes back and forth. Like, that's not realistic for my time schedule. Maybe if I had more time and if it was like a Saturday game, I would take my time and really beat my face. I'm going to... Go in with my True Complexions Contour Palette, and I'm just going to use the darkest shade to contour. And I really love this palette. At first, I thought it was too light for my skin, but I wasn't using enough of it. I'm just going to take a big fluffy brush and dip it in. And just... Mm -hmm. I'm usually in a rush I'll go and take this highlighter but at the end I'll probably add another highlighter because I like to glow and gleam and you know I never think one is enough even though it definitely is BAM I got that boom 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 yeah 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 I like to break out into random song a lot so I'm sorry if that's annoying especially when I'm in a good mood I just be breaking out into song because I love musical musicals I'm a musical theater geek also I should do a 10 random facts about me video because I did one when I first started my channel but there's still a lot of things you guys don't know okay anyways back to the video so yeah that's about it for face I need some more highlight though who am I kidding I'll get that at the end so let's move on to my eyes which is the star of the show so first I'm gonna go in with my Urban Decay primer and I'm just gonna prime my lids because duh sharing all day I'm just gonna set with a white eyeshadow and I'm using my Urban Decay full spectrum palette that one of my friends who's actually a cheerleader on my team got me for Secret Santa and I love it so much so thank you Neldine. See it's called the Copper Pepper. No, the Copper Popper palette, and I'm going to go into this orange and this brown shade to create a crease. 
First, I'm going to start with the orange and I'm just going to go in with my same brush because I don't have time to keep switching back and forth. And this is just in the blending brush and it's by Lab 2. I love their brushes. They're so amazing. So I'm just going to go and fluff this in. And I'm going to make sure that it's a good color payoff that I'm getting because I want this to be seen when I'm performing. So the makeup, the eye, the eyeshadow part takes the longest and I'm still just doing this slow because I'm recording it, but I can literally bust this look out in five minutes. I've done it before. So I'm just focusing this all over the crease, focusing this all over the crease. Some can get on the lid. It doesn't really matter. But the focus is mostly on the crease. And I'm just going to do one eye for you guys so this video isn't too long since I was already chatting. And I'm sure that's going to make it longer. Okay. So after you have a nice wash of orange, you want to then go into your brown. But on camera it does not barely look like I have every, anything on. Which is very annoying and frustrating. Okay. So now I'm going to go in with the brown and I'm going to switch brushes to these brushes that I got on Amazon and I love them. Oh my god, they're so good. And they're so cheap. They were only like $10. And I'm just going to go into the dark brown shade and zip that in. And work that in to the crease as well to add some depth. See? Ooh. Ooh. So for the smoky eye, I take my Maybelline gel liner in blackest black and I just smear it all over my lid. I coat my brush real good and then I smear it on my mobile lid. And when you're working with blacks, be careful. You do not want to look like a blackout. And this is as high as I take it because I don't want it to get messy and super crazy and nasty. So you can blend this out a little bit, the, the edges. Just to soften it a bit. And then what I do is I go in with Platonic from the Full Spectrum palette. And I put this over the black. And it gives me this nice shimmery gray color that I stink in love you're sky. and you just want to go back in with that brown shade and further blend you know blending is your lifeline blending is your friend a little blending never hurt nobody is my favorite line and you're just gonna blend these two colors together and it's gonna make a nice smoky dark brown so I go in with my NYX Gleam Eyeliner and I just take that and line my line, line my lid. And this might take a couple coats to get it, the color that you want. And it's very hard to make a wing with this brush because it's not pointy at all. But I try my best. So I let it dry and then I go in with another coat. Go underneath. And line it. And then I go in with the brown again from the Morphe Little palette. And smoke that out underneath as well. And I just dot it in the middle, right by my eye. For games, I do not wear lashes. So I'm going to take my Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. I don't care if you do. So now I'm going to put on my go-to liquid lipstick, which is ColourPop's Limbo. And... 
So now I'm gonna move on to putting in my hair bow, which is so cute. It's honestly the fav my favorite part of the uniform. So I'm just gonna take my bow and I'm gonna hold it. Not like a regular ponytail holder because when I do that, it doesn't come out right. So I hold it kind of from the top and I just place it on top of my head. And just I just loop my ponytail through the back. And then, like a normal ponytail, tie it on. Sorry, my nephew's in the background making noise. And then boom. If you want to be extra secure, you can add bobby pins and other things like that. But I don't. Ready, guys. So I hope you guys really enjoyed this. Ready, <laughs> Be careful, poopy, for my backdrop fall down. So I hope you guys really enjoyed this tutorial on how I get ready. If I gotta be a bitch, I'ma be a bad one.